hello guys this is ayuk lebe welcome to maya for beginners i'm sorry it's been a while that i did this it's just because you know um, there are other jobs and you know one has to make a living and all that kind of thing so that is why i've been gone for a while so but i'm back now and um, i will try as much as possible to do this often i mean drop tutorials for you guys often so um the tutorials i want to do today is going to be very brief and that is um you know reducing vertexes or redu reducing poly counts of your um model most times you definitely are doing it on your own you know trying to render or you're doing this for games so you might want to reduce the uh poly counts of um, the models you have in your scene so to do that just select now we have different um, meshes here we have like three meshes you can actually select everything combined or you can do it separately nice so i'm just gonna take this one as an example so i'll select my mesh go to mesh and you see reduce just click the box here so um to start from the beginning let's reset settings number one you might want to keep the original because you don't know you might not be sure of the outcome or just to be safe just keep the original i love to reduce uh, my to have the reduction method in percentage you know it makes sense that way so uh, sometimes i might want to um, try with 50 percent first um preserve quads yes i prefer you this this is just saying that um the, the quad i mean the four axis or the square of your mesh is gonna be retained so pick, uh, give it one the sharpness um this is to compress details or uh, preserve details so if you want to preserve the details or what, what, what this is saying is uh the sharpness what it's saying is at is zero it can lose its shape i mean the details how these things are it might be lost based on maybe when it reduces um you know the meshes or the poly count you might lose the, some details here so if you go to one it will actually uh, preserve this but note that if you pick one for sharpness it will affect how often or how um, precise this is is going to go so um just know just know that but if you i think the sharpness just make it zero and and move on mesh but just leave all these feature preservations leave them as they are and reduce so this is um the reduction and now you can still change um some things here i can reduce this uh it's you can see it's adding to um, the meshes i can increase this so it's adding to so you can adjust the edit or you can edit the adjustments or you can add, i'm sorry but forget about what, what i'm saying so basically you can see that it has lost um looking at the face here it has lost its features its details here so that is what we chose the other time so it has lost its details here so i i'll just go back to 50 and i'll be able to retain at least few things here so basically that is uh, what I need um, or, or where you can do this is if the, the, the mesh is in the background you so you can go as as as, as deep uh, or as high as uh, you want in, in terms of the percentage so that you can minimize you are able to minimize you know your your um, your pull count so basically that is it so thank you guys for watching this tutorial I promise that I'll be dropping tutorials often so um thank you guys um uh, i hope you learned one or two things from this um we shall be meeting again uh bye bye